Okay, so this is the case of autosomal dominant polycystic kidney, a 60 years male patient complaining of pain in abdomen. Here we can see this is right kidney, it is severely enlarged, 21 centimeter by <coughs> 10 centimeter. All of the right kidney is occupied by multiple cysts of varying size with complete loss of uh, corticomedullary differentiation. This is also right kidney. This is left kidney. It is also showing the same size. And uh, this is liver which is severely enlarged, uh, 22 centimeter right lobe of liver. <coughs> And the whole of the liver, whole of the liver is occupied with uh, uh, many cyst, innumerable cyst of varying size. Uh, spleen was, however, normal, eight centimeter around. This is left kidney once, once again, <coughs> and uh, we will now scan. This is this is right lobe of liver. And this is the right kidney. Similarly, uh, this type of same appearance is in left kidney, but patient is not able to move, uh, feeling a little, little bit pain. Uh, this is liver, and uh, pancreas is also showing some few cysts. So, this is a very rare case that we come across. <clears throat> in which uh, both liver and uh, both kidneys they are involved i had seen for the first time